boys! Today, it's a return of a recycled content piece you guys should know by now. I've given out a public address for the entire world to access, and this is what everyone sent me. If you guys want to send me something, the P.O. Box is always available to send stuff too. Real quick though, please, for the love of God, Ludwig. The name is Ludwig, okay? I, 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 I don't want to go to the window one more time and have to explain why the package says cooter on it, okay? And I don't want to have to explain what a cooter is to a 55-year-old man at a window. I don't want to have to do this. I don't want to have to do these things. So when you send the package, just try to send it with Ludwig. All right, Ludwin could fly. Maybe they just think it's a typo. That's fine. All right, Lud, sure. Ludwig, that's fine. Also sounds like it could be my name. Mr. Ogren, get fancy with it. Get fancy with it. I've never been mad about fancy. What about Air Coots? That should be obvious, all right? How about we play a fun little game? You guys, smiley face if you think the name's okay and sad face if you think the name shouldn't be used. Pussy Slayer. Okay. All right. Way too many smiley faces. Way too many smiley faces. You know what? Maybe the smiley face is confusing everyone. Let's let's switch up our voting metric. Vote yay or vote nay. All right. Vote yay if you think it should be used. Vote nay if you think it shouldn't be used. Uh, let's say, for example, a package I received that was labeled um, Big Dumpy. Okay. Should we be sending packages... That say big... Okay, I don't feel like this has been a very successful attempt at communication, which perhaps is something I could work on. I do have a communications and an English degree, so I thought we would get there, but turn around. All right. Okay, well, what do you guys think about the name Ludwig Ogren for a package? No, that's stupid? What do you mean, meh? That's even more hurtful than saying that's stupid, saying meh. What do you mean, meh? It's a good name. It's not whack, it's my name! Okay, all right, this was clearly not worthwhile. I, I regret this uh, immensely. Let's take a look at some packages. Starting with... Property of the Ludwig family. Why do new shirts always smell like shit? Oh, also this came in, this was from an old Amazon thing that I did with uh, Atrioc. He bought the most expensive Nami figurine. And the problem is it was three times as expensive on Amazon as it was on eBay. The person's just reselling it and, and scalping it. So I asked Slime to get me it on eBay and I told him to surprise me with a random Nami figurine that he thought would be appropriate for stream. And and I, this, I own this now. I own this now, this is mine. Thank you to Slime for picking me this up from eBay. Turn it around. No. No, there's actually, so she's actually wearing it. You wouldn't think it, but it's very, a lot of clothes back here. And it's, it's very, it's like, it's a wouldn't, wouldn't bother with that. Oh, it also came with, I don't know what this is for though. This was the craziest thing I've ever received in my PO box ever. From the United States Senate, which is terrifying. All right, I opened, this is the only other thing I opened up before stream today because I was terrified that I was in trouble or something. I thought I had been reported. I thought they found out that I didn't pay taxes for a while. I don't really know what's going on. I was a little stressed out, so I opened it up. And all that's inside is a piece of cardboard. And on the front, it says, and I'll read this out. I am happy to supply the material you have requested. I hope you will let me know if I can be of further assistance from Diane Feinstein, the materials requested by someone on my behalf, a self-portrait of Diane Feinstein. What the fuck is this? What is this? What, what was the message? What was the message? That's what I need to know. This is the Senator from California, Diane Feinstein. She's 88 years old. What did my viewer send to her? She signed it too. She signed it. Because it was addressed to me too. This is Ludwig. I'm a giant fan of your policy. Could you send me an autographed picture of yourself? I have an autographed picture of Diane. Yeah, it's, that's it. It's literally just an autographed picture of Diane Feinstein. Feinstein. I'll hang it up for now. I don't have a frame for it yet. That's where Diane will watch over us. Anyway, uh, thank you very much for that. Very cool. Um, maybe I can one day catch them all and get all 100 senators. Oh. 
It didn't come with anything. It just has a picture and it says the envy of them all. And then the sticky note reads for the most underappreciated roommate, Nick. And it's a picture of Falco who Nick plays in Smash. And then this is a painting. I believe it's abstract. Perhaps it's more decor than, than art. I'm unfamiliar with critiquing art, so I don't know, but, but cool. This comes from a Canadian viewer. Maybe this was self-expression on what it is like to live in Canada. It's the wrong way. <gasps> it's a mountain. <laughs> no, it's a mount. Okay, I get it now. I get it now. I, it's a mountain. Or perhaps you guys are seeing it wrong and it's Aiden's shingles. Yeah, this is beautiful. Great. I can see I can see it now. It looks like uh, the end of Evangelion Mountain. Very, very, thank you for your art. Ooh, this one's international. Delivered from Great Britain. This limited edition money can't buy coin created by our partners at the Koyo store inducts you into an amazing group of individuals. Oh shit. It's from the eSports awards. They got me a fat coin that says eSports awards and on the back it says finalist. Hey, that's what I've always said, baby. I don't need to be the best. I just need to be in the conversation. So yeah, I, a lot of you who are a little younger might not know, but uh, coins used to be a form of currency that we would exchange uh, that was centralized. Heads, every single person watching this on YouTube subscribes. Tails, they all unsubscribe. You know what the fucked up part is? You don't know the fucked up part? I flipped it in my hand like this and I was feeling it and I was like, I think that's the tail side, motherfucker. And then I went to flip it and I was wrong. I cheated and I was still, I still lost. I tried to cheat. <laughs> All right, hold up. This is the take for YouTube. Oh my gosh. What the heck? Oh, whoa. Hey guys, really appreciate you subbing. Stop. You shouldn't have. Someone also sent me these, which are really dope. Check it out. I got a bunch of pins of different emotes. So it's Ludwig Scam in pin form, and then Ludwig 7, and also Dogman, Barky Dogman, and Durs, Kitty Man, little Ludwig Jr., and, uh, and then a bunch of dupes of Ludwig 7s and stuff, which is pretty sick. Okay, this is from... Sweden? What do Swedish Ludbuds have to offer us today? Looks like a t-shirt, a medium. Okay, a little bit expectant. Hopefully this is for one of my roommates. So it looks like this is a custom printed t-shirt. Jump, oh! It's a Jump King shirt. That's badass. Wait, this is from the company that made Jump King. I totally forgot, they, they DM me a while ago. The company that made Jump King, I think it's Nexile. They're Swedish? God damn. They're the only people who are psychopathic enough to come up with a game like Jump King. The Swedes. All right, I got one Jump King shirt, and then they sent me, oh, they sent me a large in the same thing. God bless. And then they sent me a medium and large of this one. And then it's just the actual old Jump King. There's a smoking hot babe at the top cover art. Well, that's great. It says, please read off stream. Hey, Lud. Oh, wait. I'm on stream. Shit. Ludwig, from former President Obama. And it looks like you wrote your name wrong on your first try, and then you had to write it again, which is, which is weird, former President Barack Obama, to do. I'm not going to lie. I thought you kind of would have had that down. Sure. Former President Barack Obama. Oh, and it comes with stickers. All right, should we add one of these to the bottle? Octopus Man. Holographic. <laughs> this one says mom's spaghetti and on the top it says palms are sweaty ah a reference to Eminem cultured mm, yes cultured yes and then this one is like a water bottle who just drained a three at an away game and is shushing the court and then this is a combination 
trans pride, gay pride, and then that, I don't know that one, the brown and black, but I assume it's a different one. Pride. Combo flag. Army? Oh, progress. Okay. That would be insane. Talk about a mashup, huh? <laughs> My three beliefs, trans rights, gay rights, and blue rights. <laughs> Those are my big three. Thank you for the, uh, the stickers, President Barack Obama. <laughs> he put his high school and graduation announcement card in my P.O. box. Ivan. And it's him graduating from high school. It's just a bunch of selfies and pictures of him. Oh, you're a band nerd, Ivan. Ivan, this is why we get a bad rap, bro. You're you're clarinetist. You better be seat one. If you're seat two and dropping this shit. Oh shit! Wait! I'm in his I'm in his announcement. That's me! That's me! Hey Ludwig, I just graduated from high school. I figured I'd send you this announcement in hopes of a cool graduation present. You want me to give you a present? You sent me this hoping I would give you a present for graduating from high school. You graduated from high school. You're supposed to do that. 88% of Americans graduate from high school. I'm not being stingy. It just feels like we're lowering the bar these days. It follows. Anyways, I've been a viewer since before the subathon, which is more than I can say for a lot of people and have been loving the content. Have a great day, Ivan. You can send my present to the return address. <laughs> Don't put a PS. You can send my. Okay. You know what? You know what? Actually, this is great. This is great. You know what, Ivan? I was thinking. I was thinking I should get you a gift. And I was thinking, what? What? What is the best gift that that money can buy? Uh. Uh oh. Woo! The scam that is the American education system that has enveloped your life in the past 18 years, teaching you very few actual livable life skills. I came up with this action. It's a personal gift that I created for you. Um, so enjoy. Enjoy this very handmade, homemade gift. Uh, it says, Ivan, and it says, don't dox me. Well, maybe that could be the gift that I don't dox you. Not doxing you is a pretty good gift. Is that blackmail? I don't think so. Send him the Nami figurine. Okay, he just graduated high school. Let's wait a little bit, James Charles. All right, let's just give him a year or two. Well, let's not actually wait because then we're Call Me Carson. Fuck, we're going around the entire creator circuit. All right, let's just relax. How about we do that? Everybody in through the nose, out through the mouth. We'll just give him a little pin, okay? Give him slime. All right, that's that would be weird. Either way, congratulations on graduating high school. That is that's that's big. That's big, baby. So someone sent me two envelopes. One is addressed to Ludwig. The other one is addressed to Mango. And I want you to look at this and tell me. You gave him something hard. You gave him something good in here. What? This is quite flat in here. I'm noticing mine is quite. Doesn't make a lot of noise there, buddy. I, what's going on? A little bit of a misplacement, I imagine. What's, what's, um, this is weird. Mine is a letter. Hi, Ludwig. I'm not sure when this will be opened. And you'll sadly see that I haven't given you anything. I've had this gift for Mango for years. And he still hasn't opened his own P.O. box. So I thought I would send it to you. I'm a 32-month Mango sub. I don't have a long message for you. You're a great entertainer, yada, yada, yada. Everyone has their flaws, but you're a good example of what people could aim to do. P.S. Mango said you were gonna take his gift. Please don't. I'm taking your gift from Mango. <laughs> it's a fucking gold Eagles coin. It's a 1933 filled all. Is this minted in 33? No shot, right? Dude, he wrote so much more for Mango. Hopefully Mango is reading this and Lud didn't open. This is not a crime. It is not illegal. It is not illegal to open up mail that was addressed to me. It is addressed to me. Ludwig Ogren, P.O. Box 9939, Brea, California, 92822. That is addressed to me, motherfucker. All right? W what is a crime is giving something to Mango and making me deliver it to him like a, a, a pony boy. 
I need a, I need a stamp for this. You need to give me a forever stamp. This is horse shit. Next, this is an envelope in an envelope. And then inside of this envelope, it says there's protective film on the pins. Oh, this is the person who sent me the pins. And they also sent me a letter. Hi, Ludwig. YouTube frog turned Twitch frog here. Sorry for yoinking your Twitch emote art. I am not selling these. Just made them for fun. Cool. Feel free to share them with roommates or whoever. I send cutie a bunch as well. Anyways, thanks for all the content, entertainment, and laughs. I don't have anything to plug, so have a great day. From Maya. And that's also M-Y-O-H Maya underscore F-P on Twitter and Instagram. Is she in chat? She's here. Let's go! That's good news, only because she sent this two months ago, and she's still fucking here. So, I <laughs> boys, I did something right. I, I, I didn't fuck up somewhere. Or maybe you were just waiting for me to open it, and now you can go. I would have had a lifelong viewer. Every stream day, she would have shown up. Hey, you doing P.O. Boxing? <laughs> yeah, next week, next week, next week. Yeah, look. <laughs> next P.O. Unboxing? <laughs> All right, that's my bad. That's my bad. I took a, I took a while. I took a while. I took a while. I got there. What a great wholesome chatter. Thanks, Maya. What do we have here? It is a postcard, and it is a picture. <laughs> Congratulations on the pregnancy. A big huzzah to the Austrian Post who made this card free to send, and an even bigger huzzah to wasting valuable resources. Lots of love from Lucas. A Lud bud from Deutschland. Oh, and sorry, the letter starts, Hi Lud Wank, and then you wrote my name, but instead of writing it normally, you did bubble letters, and the L, bubble, is actually a penis, where the bottom of the L is the ball sack. Um, wow. It's a letter, and then a folded up 8x10 letter. Hi Ludwig, I'm Adam from a small town in an even smaller school. Now that graduation's upon me, I look back upon all that has shaped me as a person into who I am today. Thank you for the influence on my life. I watched you in late 2017 and like your Ludlocks in Try Not To Laugh videos, especially Uh Oh Stinky. I cry laughing at story time videos, like when your mom found your cum sock. That's a classic. That's become a great pastime of mine. I even own the Mogul Misty, uh, Misty Mogul Moves shirt. Although I haven't been able to watch your streams recently as life, school, and work get hard, Instead of play, I just want to say thanks from a fan and his name's Adam S And then he posted the Italian monk quite tasteful or maybe that's the French one And then there's also a much fancier card in here. What the fuck? Why do people keep sending me pictures like I'm a grandmother of their high school graduation? You look great Adam. You look fantastic a great picture. You look like a, a an understudy for the main role in, in Greece All right, you, you look great Fantastic. What, what, what do I, what do I do with this, Adam? What do I do here? Yeah, I guess I can put this on the fridge in conjunction with, uh, Ivan. So we'll have Ivan and Adam on the fridge. Just all my, all my Lud, all grown up. They're growing up so fast, boy. <laughs> all right. I have a box. Kappa. This is like a, a button. It's just a button. It's like a vest. Hi Ludwig, I have been watching and sub for over a year and I want to say hello. My mother wanted to go shopping for me for college and I saw this shirt and thought easy scam on my mom. The shirt has been washed and never worn. It may be a little big, but great quality. <laughs> you made your mom buy me a shirt? You went shirt shopping with your mom and didn't tell her you bought me something? How much was the shirt? JWE, he's in chat. JWE, what, what, how much was the shirt? Did your mom know? Hey, while we're here clothes shopping, can we get a shirt for my friend? <laughs> yeah, who? Um, so yeah, he's this, uh, so you know how I've been watching you, t so you know how I watch streams sometimes? He's a guy I watch online and I want to get him a shirt. <laughs> you have to tell her, JWE, and get the reaction and put it on the subreddit. The actual conversation would go like this. Can we get a shirt for uh, Ludwig, a streamer I watch? Is he a friend of yours? Actually, specifically the opposite. <laughs> I may not be an active chatter, but I'll be damned if I can't get a peepo hey from chat. Also, P.S. There's a blazer that randomly shipped to me. I don't know why I was sent this, but now it is for you or Cutie. 
this is some drug shit. Well, thank you, JWE, for the shirt and for the blazer. That might be for me or for Cutie. Appreciate that. And thank you, JWE's mother, for buying me a shirt. Um, that's very sweet of you. I think your son knows that I'm a millionaire. I don't know why, but but it was still nice. Great gesture. Great gesture. You look like Hillary Clinton. All right, wait for me to pour the beer before you start talking shit, please. Thank you very much. Really appreciate that, JWE. And thank you, everyone else who sent me something. Some very... <laughs> It was mostly just high school pictures and a picture of Senator Dianne Feinstein. Um, but, you know, that, that also goes a long way. So thanks a lot, boys. He said to rip it? I don't know if I can. I look like I frequent Reddit. I look great.